smoke weed every day. day, 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 day. Hey everyone, my name is Bob Brian, and today we're gonna see how to add free space um, of PowerPC in an eBoot for Advanced Warfare 110. This being said, it works for pretty much every game on PS3. So you wanna get on um, in your subviews and in the segments. What the fuck? Anyways, segments. Now you wanna check for the last part of with the last class, which is a code class. So in this case, it's the segment 15. You wanna so you wanna check um, the end address for the segment 15, which is 99559C, and you wanna check the start address of the next segment, which is segment 16. It's 9A0000, and the segment 15 is 99559C. Between those, there's a huge gap. Um, let's check it out, actually. 99559 uh, yeah 9c won't work because it doesn't exist so let's get to this address and if you check right there between segment 15 and segment 16 you'll see there's a huge gap between both if you get your calculator right real quick and you do 9a what the fuck 9a 0 0 minus 99559C there is 43,000 free bytes for PowerPC code which is really 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 awesome so you wanna get those actually for this to work you wanna open up your X editor and you wanna open your eBoot in there hello there you go so right there you wanna change the end address of the segment 15 to be actually 9A 0000. So you want to search for 9999559C minus 10,000 because this is the loaded address in the memory and right now you're just in an X editor. So minus 10,000 for this address right there. You search, it's the address, um, well, 64 in this case. So 98559C. It's actually 99559C minus 10,000. You want to change it to um, 9A0000 minus 10,000. So 99000, which is 9A, yeah, minus 10,000. So that's why. And you want to do the same. Um, four bytes after right there this is the same address you want to do the same thing 990000 now you want to save your eboot I'll rename rename it to A because of my batch file no I don't want to oh, no no All right so there's your eboot you will transfer it to your PS3 then you will load them Call of Duty Advanced Warfare oh wait just before what the fuck just before you want to open it in your, well, in IDA, because you want to test it out. Mm -hmm. Just wait. Alright. I'll do something. Um, I'll be right back when um, the game is actually loaded in IDA. Alright, it's kind of loaded, but... I'll do with it. I'll do with it. So just go to your address. Um, in our case, it's 99559C. No, okay. 5598. This will work. And right there, you will add your PowerPC code. Why oh, can't um, No. No. Really? Yes. No. Okay. <sighs> Well, I can't do it in IDA since it's gay as fuck, but I'll do it in my X editor and in the pad. So I will make a function which will, which will be um, not even this zero. No, not even. I'll just do something simple. This. So 
so I'll do this. It will store um, lead at 0x210. Scanner is really simple. Star notes. All right. So an exit will be on. Um, oh god. Uh, then it will be three eight zero zero no, one three thirty seven. And right there it will be eighty three zero 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 zero. So that will be your RPC code. You will open up your exit editor. You will open your eboot in there. You will jump to your address, 99559C, minus 10,000, remember, and in the left you put 1, whatever. And right there you'll put your PowerPC code. So, uh, what was it? Uh, there you go. Control D to, well, I'll do it. Um, paste right so it overwrites on um, your eboot and not just insert it which will change the size of your eboot and fuck up pretty much everything and you want to copy paste the DLR from the other function since you want to return oh wait control B and save it I also um this was the DLR branch to link register Um, yeah, this will work, I guess. Yeah, this will work. Alright. So, you wanna. Um, I, wanna I will close this and I will send it um, the eboot to my PS3 and I will load Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And I will be right back. Alright. Um, I'm sorry, my PS3 is loud as fuck. It's about to blow up. And it's really old. But yeah, I'll try to talk about it and I hope you guys understand, else I'll put on subtitles. So right now, I just loaded um, my L file right there. A bit windy for debugging, okay, cool. Uh, you wanna go to your channel, see if it's running, yeah. Well, it is running, but yeah. So you wanna attach it to your debugger. Which is fucked up right now. Debug here. Attach process. Come on. And you wanna press play. Yay. Now go right there. This is the address I was storing my file at. If you look at. Yeah, this is the address and this is the value I will store. Uh, fuck. Right there. Right now there's nothing. Yeah, of course. We didn't add it, uh, our code. So let's go to 99559C. You will put it in your disassembler. And that's ex exactly what I wanted to do. Yeah, that should be great. Alright. Uh, you wanna stop your your PS3? Well, the, the program. And you wanna there. Yeah, right there it will be great. I guess. You want to call um, your function, which is 99559. Uh, wait, what is it? 99559C. So you want to make a branch link register to your function. So yeah, um, the fuck. All right, I just did something. This is the branch link, branch link to uh, my function at this address. I just did it with um, the calculator. I did um, wait an x nine nine five five nine c minus uh, well the address right there, and it gave me twenty four nine e nine eight. You gotta add um, this 48000001 and then give you this. 
which is the branch link DL right there so yeah we are actually right there we're gonna step into oh it won't work yay so you wanna put a breakpoint right there you wanna press play and you wanna step into go right there you wanna step into again step into again and right now you know it works because it's actually executing the fun the instructions as it will tell you something like um, h tab miss because it's not code it's data but yeah we successfully changed it to code so store and right now it's one three 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 seven so yeah it's working and dlr so after this it might crash since it's not supposed to call a function right there and it's really random I mean I just stopped the thread and I overwrote an instruction with a deal so I guess it will crash oh yeah it just crashed alright yeah it just crashed anyways uh, that's not important to him we don't really care about it I just wanted you to show you guys and uh, we can actually get more space in our eboot with a simple fix so yeah thanks for watching and subscribe to Ballot Motors for more